everyone. Today I'm going to be opening up some stuff that I got from CD Japan. <laughs> Woohoo! Um, this is all Sailor Moon stuff, and most of it has to do with Sailor Moon Eternal, including this big, this big package at the bottom, <laughs> which is Sailor Moon Eternal. So, let's get started. So the first uh, little thing is this Sailor Moon Eternal postcard book, and inside is really just a collection of postcards, <laughs> and they're all Sailor Moon Eternal themed, and I just think they're beautiful, and I love them, and I wanted to get them. It's a little bit hard to show the book because the pages are all in a certain way, but it's so pretty. I love the artwork for this, uh, well, the set of two films, and I also actually really loved the two films, which I've said before, I'm not a huge fan of the Super S or Supers um, portion of the story, but... <laughs> I liked the manga better than the original, like, anime version of it. The manga story was a lot better, and so I feel like, obviously, the two movies were better because they stuck more closely with the original manga story, and we finally got to see, like, Mamoru taking on his kingdom and having the role that he has. So, woohoo! <laughs> Still a little bit creepy with the Pegasus and Shibuya whatever. It's fine. <laughs> the next two items are the Pretty Guardian Sailor Moon uh, Eternal The Movie. <laughs> I think it's like Crystal Season 4. Um, <laughs> is that like the official thing? It's Sailor Moon uh, Eternal or Sailor Moon Crystal Season 4. Anyway, we all know the truth about it. This is the little book that goes along with it. A little. It's pretty big. Love the pink. It's one of my favorite colors of pink. Look at that pull out art! I cannot hate the uh, the story that gives us Eternal Sailor Moon. I love Eternal Sailor Moon. I love for eternity! So really it's just um, a lot of looks at the character profiles and the main designs for the film. And since I have a lot of the original movie um, art books, I wanted to get this one. Oh, look at that. I don't even remember. I want to watch this again. I have to go back and watch the movies again. But I'm not going to lie that it kind of made me tear up. <laughs> I was so excited and happy to watch them, and I just I loved it so much. And I've been thinking there's um, like a print of this that I've been thinking about getting, because I think that's really cool. I don't know whether or not it's official, but I like it, and <laughs> so I've been thinking about getting it. <sighs> yeah, I like this one. That's nice. And the other thing I decided to pick up was this, the Anasui Special Collaboration book. Um, basically because I wanted this. <laughs> that comes with it. So the book just has, like, the different, um, information. And then inside the box, which I have not opened yet, <laughs> I 
and get in the box. <laughs> Holy cow. You get a little Anasui and Sailor Moon collaboration bag. And there are other ones of these that you can get too. I like this one. It would just be good to like carry some makeup or whatever in. It's a nice little bag. I just liked this one, so I picked it up. Lastly, let's get these out of the way. This is the big Sailor Moon Eternal Blu-ray box thing. Looks like an album cover. Ta-da! This is a non special thing. I wasn't actually sure whether I would get any of the bonus stuff with it, but I guess I did not. I was kind of hoping for the clear file, but I couldn't see a listing for the clear file on Studio Japan. And that's fine. You know, I have more than enough stuff, so I didn't really need it. So I really liked the artwork for this, which is probably a big reason why I decided to get it, because otherwise I would just wait for the... Uh, American release of it. But I loved this artwork and I thought it looked really cool um, as like a background on my one shelf. Inside you get the little Sailor Moon Eternal the movie book. And on this side, you get Sailor Moon Eternal, the movie, and then uh, bonus features. Then the original soundtrack, there's two parts. Now, I don't know if there's any difference between the CDs that I got before and these, so I'll have to check that out. I wasn't really paying attention. I didn't really care that it came with these. Um, and like I said, I'll be buying the um, American release of the movies as well. So it wasn't essential. But I love the artwork and I thought, you know what, why not? You only live once. <laughs> so there's the artwork that's underneath. And uh, there's the back. I do like that it's like in the size of a classic, you know, old record album. It's just a different feel. I don't think you get that with a lot of shows or movies. It would have been really cool to actually have an album. Hint, hint. Uh, <laughs> there you go. Woo! Yeah. I think you can still get it at CD Japan or the... Uh, Amazon, the Japanese Amazon. I'm trying to remember, is it jp.co? I don't remember, but I think you can still get it there. That is it for this video. Until next time, bye. Mm -hmm.